It is time to cleanse your mind with these shower thoughts by Tumblr. If the gasoline tax was applied to the car manufacturer instead of the driver, we'd have the most fuel efficient cars ever. The first man to land on the moon, Neil A, is alien backwards. The biggest dick move in the world is leaving tomorrow you with all the work. Sesame Street missed out on the opportunity to create a relative of Oscar the Grouch who lived in recycling bins. A fat person has more skin than a normal person, therefore they are skinnier. Hair is disgusting the minute it's not attached to your body anymore. If you use a windmill to power your electric fan, then you're basically transferring the wind to yourself. We poison and exterminate trillions of small life forms with chemicals every year. But if a higher life form came and started doing that to us, we'd feel like that's pretty messed up. 50 years later, some of these shuithuts will be used for 14 year old deep quotes. And finally, if someone pretends to be a kid online, they're most likely an FBI agent. If someone pretends to be an FBI agent online, they're most likely a kid. And this has been Shower Thoughts by Tumblr. Would you slap him for $88 million? No. No! Absolutely not. The only thing I'm slapping on him is a little kiss. Dude, I can't believe Blue's Clues finally got its own anime. I, I don't know what the screen cap is from, so I have no choice but to believe you. Dude, I already told you. It's a screen cap from the Blue's Clues anime. Look, Blue's about to give Steve his handy dandy notebook of death. Like, bruh. You paying attention? One day your child will bring home a friend and introduce them and they'll have the name of a fictional character and you silently whisper, I can't believe their parents were in that fandom. Someone in English wrote a story about how Donkey had to shoot Shrek in the zombie apocalypse because a zombified Farquaad bit him and Shrek's last words were, Use more than one bullet. Remember, Shrek shed a tear and smiled. Ogres have layers. <laughs> oh my Greg, it's all so clear now. Slap me my crackers be! I tripped over a bra today. I think it was a booby trap. <laughs> you said traps. That was like the biggest plot twist in my life. Today I learned cyanide had no effect on Rasputin in the first murder attempt because cyanide sprinkled over cakes converted to a harmless ammonia. It was cooked into rose cakes to be specific. The blending and cooking process fundamentally broke down the cyanide. I prefer to think he was just immune. After all, he is raw, raw, Rasputin, Russia's smallest who bean. In my senior drama class, I had to play Gordon Ramsay for a film project. But we can only film in school, so we had to try to find a closed off room to use. The thing is, the room wasn't exactly soundproof, and apparently someone heard us, and that's the story of how the vice principal and four freshmen walked in on me wearing a chef's hat and yelling at my friend because their squid was so raw I could still hear her telling SpongeBob to frick off. Did did you get an A? Did you get the A, Squidward? Bruh, have you ever wanted to be the center of attention so bad you cut Asia in half like god dang King Solomon? Did anyone actually ever read those Animorph books? Nah, I just stared at the covers for a concerningly long amount of time before putting it back where I found it. I mean, bruh, same. God, I can't even... I can't even make a joke about Bart going in a heated gamer moment. This... This screenshot alone looks like a damn joke. Are you... Are you telling me this is unedited? The episode name is E My Sports. Not a single encouraging word on the screen. Mm, don't like it, don't like it one bit. In the 1950s, one of the journalists criticized Marilyn Monroe saying that she's only beautiful because of her fancy dresses slash clothes. Then she did this photo shoot wearing a potato sack as a response. Straight up savagery. God bless you, Marilyn Monroe. What is the purpose of training bras? What are we trying to teach the boobs? Well, uh... <clears throat> they are trained to be the very breasts Like no one ever bras To catch them is my real chest To train them are my tatas I will browse across the store Trying on every size Need training bras to understand 
the memories inside. Booby Bone! It's time to purify yourself in the waters of Lake Minnetonka with these shower thoughts. John Wick is probably getting harder to kill because people keep trying to kill him, giving him endless experience and training. When you find money, it's simultaneously both your lucky day and someone else's unlucky day. Having your phone at full charge and still be on the charger is kind of like being awake but just staying in bed. In Harry Potter, they had potions to regrow completely new bones, change your physical appearance to someone else's, or even grow new organs such as gills for underwater breathing. Yet, Harry was still stuck wearing glasses due to poor eyesight. A small, mildly disturbing thing about getting older is how much further you have to scroll down with selecting your year of birth online. Speaking a foreign language is like emulating another operating system. It will never run as smooth as the one pre-installed, but with the right optimization, you can come pretty close. As long as you're alive, you can never be 100% sure you're not immortal. As a kid, you believe working for a company is all serious adult business. When you finally start working, you realize that most of the time, it's more of an adult kindergarten. Due dates for babies are like estimated download times. And finally, if your butt cheeks were split horizontally, they would clap when you run down the stairs. <sighs> Colonel. And this has been Shower Thoughts by Tumblr. When I was around five, I asked my mom why some people were different colors, and she said, because God wanted a lot of flavors. And let me tell you, that was the wrong thing to say, because for the next three years, I thought God ate people when they died. While I nodded, nearly napping, suddenly there came a clapping. As of ass cheeks, gently clapping, clapping at my chamber door. Tis a visitor, I muttered. Dummy thick, and nothing more. All right, since they changed Philosopher's Stone to Sorcerer's Stones for America, I decided to change the rest since us Americans are too dumb to understand the word philosophers. Harry Potter and the Whisper Snake Place. Harry Potter and that mean jail man. Harry Potter and the Hot Cup. Harry Potter and the Bird Club. Harry Potter and the guy with only some blood. And Harry Potter and Dash. So I was having a conversation with a friend about interesting D&D &D moments. He decides to tell me about one player who fulfilled his role a little differently. So this guy creates a half orc rogue, okay? Okay, different, but it could work. The thing is, he puts no points into stealth. Uh, what? Instead, he only does intimidation. He cranked the points really high. So whenever he needed to perform a stealth check, he just walk up to the people he's sneaking by and yell, You can't see, Grog! And because of his intimidation points, the people would just respond in fear, I can't see you! I can't see you! Now that is how you play Dungeons and Dragons. If you call it the waifu catalog one more time, I'm calling the cops. My DM to me when I mentioned the monster manual. I had a question, and I answered it. Mm, I'm scared! Uh-uh, don't like that! No, no, go away, go away! What is that face? It's 2017. You're working on a PowerPoint for school. It's about ancient Egypt. You select the papyrus font. Yes. Perfect. From a 9th century Irish manuscript, the phrase Massive Hangover, written in the ancient Irish text Agam, the monk must have been really having a rough day. The exact translation is Ale Killed Us, which is somehow better. Today I learned Pope Gregory the Ninth condemned the black cat as an incarnation of Satan, and consequently, it was the death warrant for the animal. This worsened the black deaths a century after Gregory's time because the plague was spread by rats, which were unchecked in Europe due to the decline of cat numbers. What I'm hearing is the Catholic Church was responsible for the plague. And what I'm feeling is not surprise. Did you yeet today, or did today yeet you? I noticed some of y'all were yoded today. Hang in there. You'll live to eat another day. Good idea. Marry a blacksmith so you can get free swords whenever. Hmm, better idea. Become a miner and then marry a blacksmith so he can have the required materials for you to get free swords whenever. And truly the woke idea? Make a harem and marry a full production chain. Now that is an anime I want to see. Stab wound? You mean extra bucket. Nobody on this website should be allowed outside, I swear to God. DM, you lose your balance and fall backwards, and as you land, you hear something in your bag break. Warlock, remembering he has four jars of live bees in his bag. <laughs> oh no! Damn, they really glowed down because that first bottle is gorgeous. That first bottle deadass looks like it's gonna make you shoot crows out of your hands. 
The first bottle is also full of liquidized cocaine. So it will make me feel like I can shoot crows out of my hands. My 19 year old brother put sports bottle lids on his chocolate milk. Thank you for sharing his wisdom with us. Bards are too powerful, they can learn mass suggestion. All they have to do is yell, EVERYBODY CLAP YOUR HANDS! And make up to 12 people do the cha-cha slide for 24 hours. DON'T EVER MESS WITH THE BARDS! DON'T DO IT! The ninth floor has temporarily been moved to the 15th floor. Also, Wednesday has been cancelled due to scheduling errors. What is this, Hogwarts? Rise and shine, Adam. You're probably wondering where you are. I'll tell you where you might be. You might be in the room that you die in. Up until now, you've simply sat in the shadows watching others live out their lives. But what do warriors see when they look into the mirror? Oh. Now I see you as a strange mix of someone angry yet apathetic, but mostly just pathetic. Oh. So, are you going to watch yourself die here today, Adam? Or do something about it? Live or die, Adam? Make your choice! Social Skill Styles, Elder Scroll Oblivion NPC Dialogue. Hey dude, how's it going? If you've got to travel by the night, stay on the road! It's the danger you see. Bruh, what? Spot the difference. Extreme mode. By the way, if I found out you looted the adorable raccoon, I'm going to find you and I will personally end you. Imagine if Bojack Horseman's final scene was a fade out to the future with Bojack in a bar saying, And that's why the long face. And knowing the creators of the show, they might actually do that and I'm gonna be mad. In 2017, we sent nudes. In 2018, we sent noodles. Now in 2019, we send things that make us feel wholesomely happy to share our love of life with each other. Do it now! What's three-sevenths chicken, two-third cat, and half goat? Chicago. A lost spirit has trouble moving into the afterlife when they cannot accept being able to see if their two favorite TV series get to meet in one special. It's a crossover episode. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so we have cute terms like waifus and husbandos, but is there one for non-binaries? Inquiring minds must know. And after posting this, Tumblr has given us the answer. Spousu! Thank you! Are you consuming the basic food groups? Coffee, pizza, rice, and mangoes, right? <clears throat> well, one of those is right. It wasn't coffee. Halloween costume idea. An upright orchestral bass with legs just plucking the strings called a walking bass line. And then somebody on Tumblr made it, and I'm terrified. I made something cursed. And it made me realize that my puns have been out of control. And for that, I offer you a formal apology. <laughs> <laughs>